welcome back to another video welcome back to the channel if this is your first time here my name is Stina Marie welcome to it's Stina's life and we are actually starting this vlog off in the evening I vlogged earlier today y'all my shirt is just really doing a whole lot of stuff okay so so yeah we're starting this vlog off at night you guys this is your first time here I am a vlogger or a youtuber located here in Oklahoma now am I like full-time YouTuber on this channel, not so much. I am a niche content creator. That is what I do. That's how I make my money. But I also like to vlog my life, which is what this channel is about. Um, also, I am just moving in our new house. Well, we are just moving in our new house only about maybe a week. And once we just got here, we had gone on vacation or to St. Louis for just a couple of days. So the house is still coming together. But yeah, doorbell just rang. Walmart just dropped off some groceries. So let me get out the porch. All right, so Walmart just brought that. And oh, girl, look at that spider. Uh-uh. Oh, shit. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, Mel. Ooh, that spider is big. Do y'all see that? Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, that wasn't it, that wasn't it, that wasn't it. Ooh, moth spray right here, girl. Ooh, no, you stay. Ah, don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. No, 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 no. Shoot. God dog it. Ah. Ah. Where are you going? <gasps> Ooh, I think that moth spray is slowing them down, y'all. Oh my God. And y'all sitting here not helping, doing nothing. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I have three cats and they are absolutely, oh, oh my gosh. They are absolutely doing nothing. Ooh, ooh, please don't. Oh no, 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 no. Don't go, don't go, don't go in the living room. Why are you not helping? This is what Oklahoma is about, girl. It's the wild, wild west out here. Girl, let me get the rest of my groceries up out this porch. What else is out here? Girl, Ooh. not me looking my whole door up and down. And what's crazy is I saw him outside. I was just saying, I gotta tell Jay we gotta spray. Like it's getting winter time, you know? I don't really know about where you guys are, but but here, like, it's not a game. Oh, my gosh. Oh, child, my whole heart is racing right now, girl. I am just so glad he did not crawl his little behind in one of these grocery sacks for me to be, you know, getting stuff out one by one. And here he come crawling up my arm. Oh, chills. I, I need a self-care night after this because this is just... All right, let me show y'all real quick. This is gonna be a quick portion of this vlog because girl, I'm keeping my eye on him. Okay, y'all, so I got some cranberry apple juice. Let me go get my tripod, hold on. Gotta get some bug spray, love. Okay, guys, so I'm just gonna show you what I got really quickly here. Now, like I said, I have been obsessed with this Walmart delivery. And y'all know I didn't like it at first. I'm the type of person I just like to grocery shop. I like to grocery shop. I know I'm a weirdo, whatever. But I like going to pick up my own stuff. However, for last minute odds and ends, y'all know, like I just said, we just moved. So we got rid of basically all our food. I don't think we brought anything but our frozen food over. We didn't bring any refrigerator stuff barely pantry stuff so i am stocking up as i need it we got these um jose olay chimichangas i just thought this would be really good to have as a quick snack or something in the freezer like when i'm busy or kind of you know too busy to stop working and actually cook like jay can warm these up himself or i can just pop them in the oven now, I have tried these before. I really think I used to like them. That's why I ended up getting them again. I feel like I used to eat these like eight, 10 years ago. So yeah, I tried it again. I got myself two of the chicken and cheese 
and I got him four of the beef and cheese. So I'm just gonna slide that in a freezer. We got some Mrs. Butterworth's syrup. Got some diced tomatoes. I'm thinking about making this pasta dish and I'm pretty sure that I got y'all all crooked. Pretty sure I didn't have any diced tomatoes. So I picked that up just in case. Um, I got some more Alfredo sauce. I have one, but these cans are kind of skinny, so I wanted to get another one. Oh, y'all, so excited. First off, shout out because, like, basically everything I bought was great value. Listen, sis be saving money. I saw this coffee, and I was like, oh, my gosh, I have to try this. Caramel pecan sounds so freaking good, and it sounds amazing for fall. So I got that got some bow tie pasta because that pasta dish i make i think it calls for bow tie pasta um also same thing i like the like i love this is probably my favorite frozen pizza totino's goes hard y'all but on days like i'm too busy or i'm editing y'all know i have like six youtube channels six or seven actually um so on days when life is life and i'm just working i pop this in the oven and it is so easy and then I got some more juices. Definitely do not sleep on the great value juice because they are bomb, especially this one, this white cranberry peach, girl. So yeah, got one of those because I like to keep that for myself. I got Jay like one, two, three cranberry juices. Well, that's really for us because I love cranberry juice as well. I got him a cranberry apple, that's his, and a cranberry black cherry, that is his too and so yeah that is all of the walmart grocery haul and i think i'm gonna do a quick amazon unboxing next girl why y'all didn't tell me i forgot to show you this too hungry jack um complete extra light and fluffy like pancake waffle mix and i got this because i just got a waffle maker which i'll show you guys I have just been really having a taste for some waffles, girl. So I wanted to get the complete because, all you know, all you have to do is just add water, basically. You don't have to worry about if you have oil, butter, all that, even though I keep that in the house anyway. But I usually end up adding milk to mine. So got this. Let me show you all my waffle maker. Okay, so I wasn't going to show you this, but let me show you this too. This is the coffee I have been drinking, and it is so bomb, the cinnamon vanilla. Actually, so I'm still like trying to figure out what i'm gonna do in this space this is like a little hutch area here so i'm still trying to figure it out i think i'm just gonna donate this um little coffee maker thing my pod from this morning girl but yeah now this hold on okay so this actually holds some utensils that i just got in here it holds this silver set um but i put them in the drawer with like all of my other utensils just because i wanted new stuff i really didn't want to carry any of the old kitchen stuff from the old house to this house but like i was saying it came with this stand and i'm thinking i can okay yeah it's time to start donating because this is just it's getting on my nerves now let's see let me put that back there put this right here okay y'all so anyway so i got this little utensil holder and i was thinking instead of just throwing it away which is like honestly what i was gonna do i could actually just put my little k cuts right here they come out and just use this by my coffee machine you know what i mean so i think i am going to do that then that way i don't have the packaging and you can still tell like what kind of coffee it is just by looking like at the lid and stuff so i think that's what we're going to do all right y'all let me get this frozen stuff in here because then you go ahead and put it in the freezer oh let me show y'all one more thing okay so one more thing i got from amazon this little sink caddy thing i'm missing the label for my dish soap i need to find it but you can see it's labeled i got hand soap this is dish soap this is a little caddy so you can put like your little washcloth up there um your little washer brush thing everything is right there and just kind of not all over the place so i'm loving that 
I had a third one, but I really don't need it up here. So I'll probably, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. Also, I got these acrylic jars here to put, I ended up putting dishwasher pods in this one since I had so many. So yeah, put that there. I just want to, like, I want this house to be a vibe. It's going to be an aesthetic. I got dishes in the sink. Don't worry about that. But I wanted to show you guys this because I'm so excited about this. This is like a ice machine, a countertop ice machine. It's by Ecozy. I'll link it down below. Got it from Amazon. And you just fill it with water. So yeah, you just fill it with water and it just makes ice all day. Now the con to it is this basket is pretty small. It's actually making ice right now, so I don't wanna pull it all the way out, but this basket's pretty small. So you will hear it kind of kick on all throughout the day, like continuously. So that's a downside, but it's pretty cool. I think I'm gonna do a video just showing you guys all the Amazon stuff I have because when I tell you, sis so been going a little crazy, sis so been going crazy. If you look under here, this cabinet lighting, it should be going off since I'm not doing anything. But I got these motion censored, um, like under cabinet lights from Amazon as well. So you see, you see it like that? Oh, it's a vibe. And you ain't gotta turn on the whole overhead light when you're walking in here. So I was happy about that. So I have one there. And I have one over here it's a little harder to oh, okay yeah have one over here too and this is like the little overhead part so because i have two more of the strips i was thinking about putting it under there but it's so big i have these other lights that i think i'm going to put under there you guys know well if you watch the other vlog i just got done eating we had fried fish, salad, and french fries. So anyway, I think about putting these other lights right under here and then, and then using like the other two strip lights under here. So basically everything gonna be lit up, love. All right, y'all, let me go ahead and put my frozen stuff up before I be unhappy when everything's thawed out. So I'll be back.